Welcome back guys to another Fortnite gaming video. Today we're going to be talking about my thoughts of Fortnite Chapter 2 Season 7. Let's get started. First topic is of course going to be the items and weapons. I'm sure we could all agree that the items and weapons were a very big part of this season. So there's only one way for me to show you how awesome they are. A little montage. And there you go, guys. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the weapons this season. I 100% did. And hopefully, Fortnite's going to hit it out of the park next season with awesome new items and weapons. Next topic is going to be map changes. Here we are about the map. Now, I think this was a huge improvement on what we got for the last two seasons. The last two season maps were just boring and dull. They needed more map changes. They just needed more. And this season gave us a lot more. It wasn't the best map changes we ever got, but it definitely was a huge improvement. I would like to see next season more bigger map changes like the Stark, like the, the Marvel season. We had that gigantic Stark Industries. That was amazing. Probably one of my favorite map changes in Fortnite history in my opinion so really looking forward to see some more map changes but overall this was a great map looking forward to the next season next topic is going to be the battle pass now a lot of you guys watched my battle pass review and I'll be honest I was a little negative towards it it wasn't my first time seeing the battle pass it was my first impression but in time when I unlocked all the stuff I gotta say it's actually a pretty cool battle pass. So this is going to be a quick review on what I thought of it. I'm going to rate it 1 out of 10. Here we go. Now, all the items were great. The highlight of the battle pass, in my opinion, was definitely going to be the emotes. The emotes were really, really good. I think Fortnite did a very, very good job with everything they gave. Um, each emote was unique. Each emote was awesome. I think Fortnite really thought about the emotes, and that I really appreciate. The skins were okay you know the skins were okay they were fine it, it was part of the theme they were good i'm not gonna start you know sort of like hating on all the skins they were good they're just not my type of skins i mean obviously sloan was the tier 100 skin i mean it is of course rick but whatever i think sloan's meant to be the main skin of the battle pass in the storyline but yeah it was a very good battle pass thing the items were really cool just not my type of items but as a whole this battle pass definitely was better than the last two. I'm sure we could all agree. So that my review, my um, I'm going to rate this battle pass out of 1 out of 10. I'm going to give it a 6. Okay, it's going to be a 6. Now, the only reason I'm giving it a 6 because the emotes were good. I think the uh, sprays were good. They weren't crazy good, but they were good. And yeah, everything else was okay. But I think what gives it a 6 out of 10 is definitely going to be the emotes. So that is going to be my battle pass review. Next topic is going to be the storyline. Now, I have mixed feelings about the storyline this season. Now, before I start saying all this stuff, I just want to say this is my opinion in the end. There is nothing wrong with liking this storyline. There really isn't. Everyone has an opinion. Everyone, yeah, Fortnite's Fortnite. So, when this season came out and I saw the trailer, it was exciting. Always when you have a new season, it's going to be exciting. New stuff. I mean, Fortnite is very good at making people excited because their seasons are so large and so big. So, of course, they're going to be excited. But I'll be honest, this storyline just, just didn't seem that interesting to me. I get it. It's the Fortnite characters versus the aliens. That seems really cool. But I just don't like where it's going. Now, obviously, in order for me to say all this stuff, i got to give an example of a good storyline. Okay, here's one. Midas, season two, chapter two, season two. That was an amazing storyline. I remember telling my siblings, oh my gosh, this is so cool. Midas is the villain. He's going to try to, you know, flood the whole island or whatever. I was really excited. I really was. And this season just doesn't have that energy. And obviously, we didn't see the live event yet. I didn't see it yet. So I can't really say it's a bad storyline i just don't feel like this season really gave enough hype 
for me to be excited for the live event. I like live events in general. I think they're the best part of a Fortnite season. We're going to find out exactly what happens on Sunday. And yeah, we'll see what happens. But I just don't think this storyline was that great. I think Fortnite should have added more or did something. It just felt very bland to me. But we're about to find out on Sunday. Hopefully it's a great event. And hopefully we're going to have an awesome season. And finally, the verdict. What do I think of this season? What do I rate this season as a whole? Now, this season had a great map, great items and weapons, um, great battle pass, but the storyline was kind of bland for me. I didn't like the storyline. I was not hyped for it. I love live events, and I, of course, will be hyped for that, but I did not think the storyline in general was good. I kind of wish that Fortnite could take some inspiration from chapter two season two because that was a great season the storyline was really awesome so hopefully fortnite's gonna do it this season so i'm gonna rate this season here we go a seven out of ten the reason why i'm giving it a seven and people could think that's a very high score very low but probably high is because this season improved a lot from the last two and when fortnite does that it proves that this game has hope and i think a lot of things in this season was awesome I, when i first saw this season when it first came came out i was excited i was really excited to play it and the last two seasons i wasn't you could ask my friends when the season came out of the last two i was not excited already the first day i was bored this season did not have that of course i had moments that i was bored but the first day i was hyped this seemed like a very good season not for the storyline but i think for the map and weapons so seven out of ten is is my uh is my opinion and what I rate this season. So anyways, guys, that's gonna be my thoughts of Fortnite Chapter 2 Season 7. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe. And if you got this far, comment Avatar in the chat. And remember to use code AvatarElly in the item shop. See you until next time, guys, and stay safe.